This is Chris with Dive Zone Scuba for another technical diving tips, techniques, and trips video. In this video, we'll be discussing the Technical Diving International or TDI Extended Range Course. The Extended Range Course uh, includes the training and experience um, to use air uh, in dives up to 180 feet that require uh, decompression using nitrox and oxygen. Air is specifically used as the bottom gas and this is not a trimix course. The use of air at these depths can present some issues such as nitrogen narcosis and oxygen toxicity. These are addressed in the extended range course. The extended range course is a standalone decompression course which emphasizes the use of a total of two stage deco or travel cylinders uh, in any combination. This makes the extended range course a valuable addition to any technical diver, particularly if they do not intend on using Trimix. Because the extended range course is not required to take the Normoxic Trimix course, and the Normoxic Trimix course also addresses the use of two cylinders, many divers opt to bypass the extended range course and go directly to Normoxic Trimix. The extended range prerequisites include decompression procedures, the diver must also be 18 years old, and the diver must have a minimum of 100 dives. At least 25 of those dives must be at depths greater than 100 feet. As with the decompression procedures course, the equipment requirements for the extended range course can be uh, somewhat difficult to understand. Uh, there is quite a bit of flexibility uh, permitted in the standards, and this includes the situation with the primary gas cylinders. Uh, appropriate cylinders and volumes must be used and they do require a either a dual valve, a double manifold, or independent double tanks. So you could actually technically stay within certification standards by using a giant 149 cubic foot uh, Faber steel tank with an H valve on it. However, the more normal configuration will be a double manifold, side mount, or independent double setup. You also need two travel, stage, or deco cylinders with the appropriate regs and submersible pressure gauges. Most people will use either a plate in a wing or a side mount rig. The remaining equipment items are what you would expect of a course of this nature. The course content includes eight classroom subject areas, which is available online, and a total of four dives. Here are the eight subject areas. The course starts out with a discussion of deep air diving. And again, uh, this is significant as this course only uses air, not Trimix, and uh, some divers uh, have issues with nitrogen narcosis and oxygen toxicity at the maximum depths available to dive in this course. So there's a significant discussion on that. Uh, the procedures uh, subject area is also very large, and this is due to the whole issue about uh, diving with uh, multiple stage deco or travel gas tanks. The course consists of a total of four dives, must be conducted at a depth of greater than 100 feet, and two of the dives must be conducted at a depth of greater than 130 feet. You can, of course, uh, for example, do four dives all greater than 130 feet. The bottom time for all four dives must be at least uh, a total of 100 minutes. This will be actually quite easy to achieve as a single dive, a single decompression dive, 
with two decompression cylinders could easily take 50 minutes by itself. On the successful completion of the extended range course, divers will be certified to plan and conduct deco dives at depths up to 180 feet. However, there was also the limitation that the dives that the divers should be doing uh, should be approximate to the training dives. So what that means is that uh, you need to be careful and not to uh, exceed uh, any training that you have received during this course. Additionally, just because you are certified to dive to 180 feet on air does not mean that it is necessarily a good thing to do. There are significant nitrogen narcosis and oxygen toxicity issues that we have discussed already in this video. So the primary value of this course is to develop proficiency with using two deco stage or travel gas cylinders. And it is also valuable for technical divers who have no intention uh, to further their education by taking a trimix course. The course will also qualify you to take the TDI Normoxic Trimix course. However, you are already qualified to take that course at this level since you have credit for decompression procedures. This is Chris with Dive Zone Scuba. I hope this video was helpful and thanks for watching. Please subscribe.